here is a 1984 Toyota Celica GT and I really hate to use the like new um, but this car kind of is it is beautiful factory gold it's got the GT package all the extras <laughs> beautiful car I'm gonna do a once around here and I, I, I hate Japanese cars. I drive Mercedes-Benz, Cadillacs, Chevys, Pontiacs. That's what I love. That's what I grew up. Just love them. Always would talk crap about Jap cars. And still will. But not this one. Whoever had this thing loved it, cared for it, and it's truly a classic. It's truly a collector's antique car. I mean, look at this thing. As far as the paint goes, it's beautiful. All the lenses are great. This one here is cracked. Wheels are great. Tires still got little titties all over the side, probably about 80%. This here is a teeny bit discolored. Paint even on the roof is great. A couple of little areas there. He probably dinged it into a, something when he opened it. I love these scoops on the back. On this side, there's a couple door dings here. This is fading the black right along there just a tad bit. And I just want you to see anything that I see on it. And it's definitely, you're not gonna find a cleaner one. This car is awesome. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and show you the inside, which pretty much even amazes me more than the outside. Um, pedals. Great condition. One owner, 122,000 original miles. Seats are, as you see, like new. Here's a little tear here. And this here he put around here to keep that from splitting. The back seats don't look like they've ever been sat in. And he put these little doilies up here with some pins. I pulled the pins out to show you that it did its job and protected it. I mean, whoever had this took care of it. And um, it's in great condition and it shows. The headliner is in perfect condition. I mean, it's just amazing. All the lights work and everything. i go ahead and get inside and show you. And here, I'll fire it up for you. And Wipers work, everything works. It shows 122, 893. AC blows cold as can be. Um, the windows work great. The driver's one works fine, it's just like the button catches a little bit sometimes. But works fine. Um, like I say, AC is ice cold. All the little compartments here are all. Listen to that. Shuts hard. The rears works fine on the wipers. All the compartments are here. Mirrors work fine. This little compartment's here on a. You know, I've got the one for the driver's side. It fell off. And there it is, where you can fix it. That dash is beautiful. No cracks in the dash. You're not gonna find one like this. That's all I got to say. Look at the door jam. The car's like new. It really is. In the back here, a couple pieces of tape on there. As you can see. such a pretty car. I don't know if that Jack's ever been out of there. Wow. 
Wow. No, this ain't been out, man. Look at this. This is amazing. This bag, I don't know if the guy ever touched it. <laughs> this needs to go to a car show, people. And that's all there is to it. It needs to go to a car show. This little thing over here, they usually all break off, but everything's on here and it works like it should and it's all there. Amazing. I don't know if I've ever looked under here. Oh yeah, I remember this. Beautiful shape. I don't know if that's ever been out of here. Man, I mean, look at this. It's amazing. The car is literally like new. A couple bumper stickers on it that I didn't take off. I'll go ahead and show you under the hood here. I like to go on a little test drive. If I can hurry here. We'll split on this one. We put that rope around it to hold it. it seems to have worked great. Let me show you under the hood. Then we're gonna kind of scurry here, and I'll. Um, I guess I didn't pop it. I like new under here too. 22 RRE, the one of the best motors they ever made. <coughs> Get close up here. It doesn't leak all over or nothing. I'm sure you find some kind of leak on somewhere, but. Nothing that shoots it all over. It's just beautiful. It's in great shape. Whoever had this maintained it great. That's pretty much our once over here. I'm gonna grab my monster drink here and my tire dressing. Throw it in the back seat and take you guys on a test drive. I get 10 minutes on YouTube. Got a couple left. Why not? I mean, this thing, it's a joy to drive. And here we go. Going about 38 according to the speedo. The speedo is off a little bit. I think it goes um, slower than the speedo sets. went by a little radar sign and it said um, it was, I was going, I think I was going 41 on here and it read 37 or 38. So, that's pretty much it man. You turn on a dime, shifts and steers like a dream, and you're not going to find a cleaner car. I mean, if you want a classic Celica like this, this is it. And check out my website, it's serialmarshmallows.com. Click on blog and you can see a lot of the different cars I have for sale. My name's Nathan and you can reach me about this car at 406-544-6919. And make sure to check out some of our other videos on here. I always have lots of neat, unique Euro and classic cars. I tell you, I honestly don't get that many Japanese cars like this. But I'm glad I got this one. So go ahead and give me a call anytime. Nathan, 406-544-6919. And thank you very much for watching.